Good day, children. Today, we're going to have another lesson that will surely help you with your math skills. And the title of our lesson for today is Reading and Writing Numbers from 0 to 1000. And to start, let's recall. Now, we have here the numerical symbols and their number words. So we have here 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. And then, we also have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. And now, to make it easier for us to count and write numbers, we only need to remember our skip counting by 10. So we have here 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90. And of course, we have here the hundreds, like 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, and 1000. Now, for example, we want to write the number word for the numerical symbol 151. So, we have to go back to our number chart and look for the number word for 100. So, 100 is here, there. That's how you spell 100. And, of course, the number word for 50. So, 50 is here. And then, the last one is 1. So we have here 1. So we have 151. And it looks like this. There. 150 and 1. But as you notice, there's a line between 50 and 1. And we call it a dash. Now, remember to always put a dash between the 20s 30s, 40s, and so on, and the numbers in ones. And the examples are like this. So we have here 50 2, but we read it as 52. Then we have here 60 4, but we read it as 64. And we also have 70 7, and we read it as 77. So there. Now, another example will be G100. 23. Again, it's 323. And let's go back to our number chart. So we need to look for the word for 300. So 300 is there. There. And then, of course, we have 20. And then the last one will be 3. So it looks like this. 323, and we can spell it this way. 323, and there's the dash between 20 and 3. Then, we have another example. Oh, we have here 1015. So, oh, we are already on 1000. So, as you can see, one the 1 is separated from 0 and 15. And we write 1,000 this way. So, how do we write it in words? Again, we're going to look for the word 1,000. And then, we only need to look for the word 15. So, it's 1,015. And this time, it looks like this. So, there's the space again. And 1,000, comma, and then there's 15. So that's how you write 1015. And now, remember, we can write numbers from 0 to 1000 using symbols and words. And we can use the skip counting by 10 to make numbers easier to write and spell. Now, Let's give our mind some exercise. We have 
117. Now, how do we spell it in words? So, let's look at our number chart. Hmm, we have here 117. So, there. You can look at the number chart. And then, the answer is... One hundred seventeen. Next, two hundred fifty one. So look for two hundred fifty one, and the answer is two hundred fifty one. So there's a dash between fifty and one. Another four hundred forty. So again. Look at the number chart. Look for 440. And the answer is 440. And another one, 778. So, we look again at our number chart. And the answer is Seven hundred seventy-eight, and the last one, nine hundred eighty-two. Let's go back again to our number chart, and it looks like this: nine hundred eighty-two. Very good. Great job, grade 2. Now you already know how to read and write numbers from 0 to 1,000.